A 16 year old is facing multiple surgeries after the sheriff's office says he was shot last night in a crowded Sherman Park. In the city at large, shootings are up compared to the last three years. 95 shootings, deadly and non fatal so far this year. Julia Fellow learned more about what happened last night and community stakeholders who say this needs to stop. The sheriff's office tells me all of this happened right here. There were 50 to 100 teenagers arguing and even fist fighting. Then it led to gunfire and a 16 year old was shot in the back. That teenager is recovering tonight at Children's Hospital. The 82nd victim under 18 to survive being shot in Milwaukee this year alone. A homeowner nearby tells me he saw the commotion last night and hopes whoever did this is caught. Feed him a lesson. Give him the max. Montreal Kane says violence like what happened Tuesday night is why he created Mira to help our next generation. It stands for monitor, engage, recommend, advocate. I came here six years ago and had a conversation. What would it look like if these young people could actually have somewhere to go at night? Partnering with the Running Rebels organization, he says he's helped nearly 750 young people resolve their disagreements peacefully. How many do, would you say uh, mediations do you do a week with teenagers? Maybe 13, 14. And whether it's over a game or a girl crush, he shares ways for children to find peaceful outlets. Get your attitude adjustment playlist. Find those songs that make you want to feel alive. Because someone opening fire in a crowd of teenagers in Sherman Park should never have happened. Julia Fellow, TMJ4 News.